Hello friends, welcome to my channel. This is Charan. This is the final part 3 of the crude windows application. And here we got the output. I am selecting the employee ID 17 which is uh, Mohit Kumar. Delete. Say record deleted successfully. Click OK. See here. The record is successfully deleted from the table. If you are a first time visitor to my channel, please subscribe to get the latest updates. In my previous part 1 and part 2 I have showed how to insert and display records in a data grid view control. And part 2 I have showed how to update the selected employer details. Now in this video I will show you how to delete a selected employer record. If you missed my previous part 1 and part 2 videos, at the end of this video tutorial you will get those links. Now let's start to delete the employee record. Double click the button control of the delete. And here we got the button click event for the delete functionality. Now first I am adding the connection strings. Copy the one and pasting here. If you don't know how to add the SQL Server connection string in the app.config file, in my part 1 video I have explained clearly. Please watch that video. List string employee select is equals to new list string. I am creating an object for the data grid view role. Data grid view row row is equals to new data grid view row for int i is equals to 0 i is less than equals to data grid view 1 dot rows dot count minus 1 i plus plus row is equals to data grid view 1 dot rows i next i am checking the condition if the checkbox is selected or not in the data grid view control if row dot cells the checkbox control the column is a 0 the first column dot value equals to true and the selection checkbox type is a boolean so I'm converting here convert dot to boolean string id is equals to row dot cells dot value dot to string employee select which is a list string object dot I am adding the string item which is id for each loop string s in employee select sql command sql com is equals to new sql command which takes two parameters one is a statement command type which is a delete statement delete from the table name is dbo dot employee facing here where id is a column single quotes plus plus double quotes single quotes double quotes I'm adding here between plus plus s comma the second parameter is the connection object which is the SQL con. I'm pasting here. 
let's execute the command sql command dot execute non query after execute the delete statement i want to display the message the selected record is deleted successfully message box dot show record deleted successfully I'm closing the connection string close method after that calling the display data function which is this one this display function is to display the records in a data grid view control display data method here we forgot to open the connection string sql con dot open method let's check the output the selector employee is deleting or not start and here we got the output i'm selecting the employee id 17 which is uh, mohit kumar delete say record deleted successfully click ok see here the record is successfully deleted from the table that's it